match up, <laughs> you would say, on paper. Yeah, it's it's going to be a long one. That I can absolutely agree with. Uh, Sonic just doing such a good job at uh, disengaging. And we Fit Trainer has means of full stage coverage, but oftentimes those come at... They're not something like a Rob laser or a wolf laser, for instance, right. where it's just like you press this button, it comes out like it's covering a consistent plane. Uh, Volleyball is not doing that. Soccer ball, whatever, you know, sport ball, sport. <laughs> whereas, whereas we Fit Trainer, I think, is more so about holding down the fort in her very specific positioning. Uh, but I guess we'll see how that plays out already. Kamek's now at the ledge, but clean spin charge gonna get him back to center stage yeah and i like it, it's really good for louis that both of them seem to just agree on pokemon stadium too because while sonic does enjoy this stage the added by platform layout is so nice for uh for we fit trainer it means you can almost uh, guarantee some follow-ups off of down throw instead of it being kind of a chase but that was an amazing call out on the deep breathing taking a risk and it paying off with the spike hitbox of down air. Don't see that one too much in comics, making sure Louis Jesus remembers it. Making, trying to make sure that this set does not go nearly as long as we thought it would. A back air, not quite. Ooh, trying to threaten with the spring, but good uh, drift there by Louis Jesus. Yeah, we've seen comics bounce back and forth between these platforms with a lead like this. You can play rather defensive, but comics is just deciding, hey, Sonic is so good at like putting on damage and gaining a lead. What if I just don't give up advantage? And lo and behold, a two-stock lead comes out for Comex. As a Wii Fit Trainer, without deep breathing, sometimes the speed can get extremely overwhelming. Another fantastic call out by Kamex. All right, now Louis Jesus back in the corner. Wow. The forward air going to be putting him in a potentially precarious spot, but he makes it back to center stage. 69 right. and going for another back air, but Louis is able to win that uh, to win that interaction with a downer of his own. At 144, the hard part is going to be finding a kill move on Sonic, and you're not going to find, okay. neither of them are going to find it just yet. Going all the way across the stage, Dragon Ball would be proud, but we're not done yet. Now we are done. Another fantastic punish by Kamex, making sure Louis Jesus does not get comfortable at all picking any of Wii Fit's offstage options. Because that's what all three of those kills were, were punishes for Louis Jesus trying to do something Wii Fit typically does offstage. Set up deep breathing, it's threatened with header. Um, I think, I don't remember what the second one was. I think this moment, th that moment where it was a low stock kill a, or a low percentage, a spiking kill, it, it, sent, it changed the entire dynamic of that game one because suddenly Louis wasn't comfortable on ledge. Louis wasn't comfortable going low. Spring and down air were suddenly these massive threats that they had to think about, which resulted in two more stocks being taken while Louis stayed high for just too long. One with a back air and one trying to recover high on stage. Got caught with a forward smash. Mm -hmm. you, can't you can't remove your entire game plan just because of one uh, unfortunate interaction as Louis Jesus tries to get back into form and get back into flow, challenging all of the startup on spin charge. And that's exactly what they, they need to do before things get out of hand too quickly. Oh my great chase with the spring. Oh, I think uh, Louis Jesus wasn't ready to land on the spring there. Kind of put him in an awkward air dodge situation, giving Kamex another hit there. Oh, but these backers are coming out from Kamex. They are determined to find these hits and to use Sonic Speed as an offensive tool just as much as a defensive one. Coming down with the back air and the lingering Even hit the will soft do hit. it. Yeah, getting caught in the knees or getting caught with the knees. And Comics gets a chance to extend this lead uh, at least a little bit. Sonic does have some pretty potent combos out of charge, but these charge moves from Louis are keeping that those at bay. Running off the platform forward, uh, getting caught by Louis forward air. Louis did a great job of managing stage position, so though despite the early edge guard, they're far from out of it. And deep breathing, yeah, that'll That's do big it. big damage right there. Huge, absolutely massive. 
So they do need to get a little bit more than 40 if they're going to have it. Uh, if they're going to feel comfortable with this lead. Right, but Luigi is starting to find his um, starting to find his rhythm, starting to get the uh, the Wii Fit things that he wants. Setting up. All right, nice save. All right, I like what Luigi just did there by canceling out of the deep breathing. That's something that he's been punished for quite a bit so far in this set, was doing the deep breathing in that exact scenario. So mixing it up there with the air dodge got him back to, back to the stage. Throwing out at 95 at this point. The early, uh, the release hitbox of Spin Charge being super effective at getting by many of these smaller projectiles and dealing with the volleyball. Though at 150, you got to think, if, uh, does Comics have a little bit of a trick that they can go for? That back throw won't do it. And it does give Louis time to go for this deep breathing. A re-grab, but an immediate get-up attack gets Comics out of danger. And another back air. Great, Great DI. DI. Uh, and a little bit of help from deep breathing as well to reduce the amount of knockback they took. We were right back in this scary situation. Both characters, such high percentages. Kamek's getting into that deep red. Dash attack not going to do it, but it does put Luigi's back off stage where Kamek's got all of his kills last game. Whiff grab, no, another whiff grab and a back throw will do it. I wonder why look for the grab at those higher percent. Oh, uh, well, I mean, we fit forward throw is potential for a kill throw, but neither here nor there as Kamek's Looks to try and take them for a ride. Charging up the spin attack, uh, excuse me, the homing attack, not going to find the mark thanks to the platform. And Louis Jesus, once again, keeps rather close. Missing the confirm off the back air, and Louis set up on ledge. Ooh, get by with the roll on. Heck. All right, Kamex has been putting on great pressure here at the ledge, making sure everything is as safe as can be. Not giving Louis Jesus an inch to punish. Oh, I think they were expecting to not land on the stage there once more as they got an opportunity to get punished. Great fake out thanks to the uh, the sun salutation being canceled. Damages at pylon high as that air dodge was buffered. Oh, wow. the stock fell. I want to no. say that was also such great positioning there by Kamex throwing out or charging up that F smash because the soccer ball was right there would have extended the hit, uh, the hitbox. Yeah, very, very true. We can watch it bounce in this replay right here. It's very well played from comics all across the rank, all across the the board. We can get a nice look at that volleyball mm -hmm. bouncing around there and sent with him. Did they get hit by the ball at the end? No, I no, don't think I don't so. Believe no, believe so. Just died to the F smash, just raw. It is a crazy strong forward smash. The extra damage from the ball certainly helped. Though, as and I mean, this was just very, it was a very strongly played game from comics because in game one, we got to see what is so good about Sonic and Elite in many different facets. You can choose to snowball, you can choose to camp, you can choose to run away, like or utilize Sonic Speed as an amazing uh, with punish range. But in this game, it was always very, very close, and Louis Jesus found themselves with a lead time after time as we see the back throw kill. What changed up from game two was what seemed like comics was natively best at or natively wanted to do, which is edge guard. He wanted to go out. He wanted to play close to ledges, and it worked out uh, at the very least once early and twice over in a, a traffic situation, catching a roll, catching a whiff grab. Solid stuff from comics able to show off the, the, the multifaceted nature that uh, Sonic can play at. You don't always have to use that speed to run away, though sometimes you do have to.